Now, look, this is my hometown, gang. This is St. Louis, Missouri. Look at this crowd for the truck race. All on their feet right now. What, 50,000 people or so? I'd say plus. Is the truck series alive and well? And, and kicking. <laughs> Shane Meal, Bobby Hamilton, and Jack Sprague had been running the fastest laps out of any of the trucks towards the end of the race. Jack Sprague blew a right front tire. He's out of it. Now it's between Shane Meal and the number 15 and the four of Bobby Hamilton. Remember, we saw what Bobby Turned Hamilton down. tried to pull off on this restart. Shane Meal, he brought him down so slow, Kenny, I think that's why 30. he spun the wheels. Let's see how he does this time. 30. A lot better start for Shane Meal that time. Bobby Hamilton touched right in behind him as they worked their way into turn number one. Ooh, Shane got a really good start right now, but here he goes again. Bobby drives to the outside. He pulls up beside him Does again, Kitty. My gosh, this is incredible. They're big. Oh, they hit the wall. Oh. Bobby Hamilton up almost on two wheels and into the wall. The caution's going to fly again. That's Chad Chaffin will move into the top spot. But we haven't got the white flag yet. We will have another green-white checker. I knew it was going to happen. I drew the picture. I said, your leader is a young kid. You've got the veteran on the outside. They are still wrecking as we look at Bobby it. Bobby Hamilton right now is wide open, right, wide open, turning into Shane Mill. Okay. Bobby Hamilton can't see anything right now. He's got smoke flying out of that truck. And like you said, he's got smoke coming out of his ears, too. Okay. Let's take a look back at why the eighth caution flew at Gateway. Oh, we see what happens. Shane Mill gets sideways and loses it. Yeah, it was not a situation where he just tried to drive Bobby Hamilton in the wall. He was doing all he could do to try to keep the lead, and he got sideways and it ran out of racetrack. He and Bobby Hamilton made contact. Bobby almost got upside down. There's where you see Bobby's uh, trying to make sure that Shane gets his truck off the racetrack and out of the way. He doesn't want Shane to gain any positions. But you know what? As upset as Bobby is, you can hear the motor wound up. You know, we looked at that replay. We got we got to give that 15 truck, you know, uh, a round of applause for, for trying to win the race. He was wide open and dead sideways.